Hello and welcome to another episode of Rainy Day Brain. I'm Ken. Tonight I want to talk to you about um, the anxiety that I deal with. You see, I feel like more often than not time is my enemy. I get very stressed very easily thinking about all the things that I want to do or have to do. For example, practice my violin so I'll get better at it, record a new Bad Badger Jokes video, maybe record another chapter in my audiobook podcast, record videos like this one for a rainy day brain, start outlining a new mini version of my Feel This Pain series, and in fact reboot my Feel This Pain series. I want to write letters to all of my pen pals using my nifty new fountain pen, but I still need to do laundry, of course, go grocery shopping, exercise, play with the cat, and above all, spend quality time with my wife, Karina. And that itself can include all sorts of things like video games together or watching any of a dozen shows on Netflix and Hulu and Amazon and all that, cooking dinner together. All of this, of course, has to happen around my day job. And this is not a big deal for normal people whose brains are wired normally. For someone who suffers with anxiety and depression, though, uh, it's another matter entirely. Uh, thinking about any of these tasks, whether fun or not, for too long, uh, all the m multiple competing priorities just start my brain into this downward spiral of shame and anxiety that will literally leave me curled up on the couch. And I start to question my worth as a person and how I'm failing at YouTube and being creative in general and I'm not progressing at my violin fast enough and I'm failing my wife for not spending enough time with her. When this starts to happen, all I can hope for is that I recognize that it's happening to me and then mentally just yell at the top of my mental lungs, mental lungs, stop. I have to yell at my own brain to stop. And then I have to go through that list of things and itemize why all the thoughts that I have been having about those things are wrong. Every word of what you just said was wrong. <laughs> I have to then remind myself that I am not a popular YouTuber and so really nobody cares when my next video comes out. And I'm not playing in an orchestra, I'm in fact only playing violin for myself and my wife really at this point, a couple of friends, so it's okay if I don't progress amazingly fast. And it's also okay to not watch all of the amazing shows that are available to watch right now, and then I cannot feel guilty for just choosing to read a book or a magazine and just nope right out of watching anything on TV. And then finally I remind myself that the most important thing is spending quality time with Karina. The rest of it is just there. If I don't stop my brain storm in time, well, that's what the Xanax and a hot mug of loose leaf tea are for. But I don't like that option. I like the tea, but I don't like to depend on stuff like Xanax. So, that being said, I would like to hear how you deal with your anxiety issues. If you wouldn't mind sharing any tips or tricks that you might have in the comments down below, I would appreciate it. And maybe people who watch this video might also learn something from your experiences. And that's where I will leave this episode. Thanks for spending time with me tonight. If you have any questions, go ahead and send them to me, Ken at don'tpunishpain.com. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. All right, take care, everybody.